Hi guys, Yvette here with the massively huge, huge spring fashion haul. I won't sing, I will spare you that embarrassment. I should spare myself that embarrassment actually. But I'm so excited to be showing you all the goodies I've been getting. I swear I don't have any bills to pay or anything. I literally went insane. But there's just so much cute shit out there. I'm just like, ah! like every time I go into a store, I'm just like, seriously, like... Um, so, uh, let's get started. Um, excuse my hair. It is faded as fuck. Like, it's just super faded right now. My roots are coming in. I need to go get my hair did. And I'm trying something different with my eyebrows. I don't know if you guys like it or not. Should I do the red eyebrows with the red hair? Is it too much? Do you like taupe brows? My friend Martha told me to try taupe brows. So, you know, I'm trying it for you, girlfriend. Okay. I went to icing and got these super cute floral headbands. I saw this on the little mannequin guy and I just died. I think it is just so freaking adorable. Like, uh, I've just died. I remember when these first came out, I was just like, okay, like this is like little girl quinceañera, like niña de recuerdos kind of a thing, but uh, I totally fell in love with this trend. And now I guess I just went ballistic. Do you guys like this trend? Are you rocking it? I mean, it's kind of, it's cute to hide your roots too. So maybe that's why I like it. And then I got this one that's a little bit more simple. But it's still, it's still kind of big. Not as big as the other one, obviously. But these were really cute and they were buy one, get one half off. This one was $10. And then this one was $18.75, which is... Obviously a little bit pricier, but it's just so freaking adorable, and I just love how it looks with my hair. So, that's all I got at Icing. And then I went to Target. It was raining when we went, too. But it was cool, because there's less people out in the rain. Which is awesome, because I don't like to shop when there's just, like, hordes of people. I, I get overwhelmed, and I'm just like, get up there! Okay, so I did get some shoes. And these are so cute. Like, oh, like, these are just super cute like when I got them my friend Gabby was like ugh and I'm like you're ill like these are cute like I just love the color I don't have any boots that have like lace on them and I wanted to get like this kind of shoe like an all loafer like you know the loafers they have like all this lace on it but I'm just thinking it's just gonna get dirty they're not gonna last so this is like the next best thing for me I would totally wear this with floral dresses like with shorts and like a cute top or something with some over the knee socks like I just think this is super spring super cute and then this bag which is super cute but it got flat it's okay it got a little flat in on the ride over here but it's just like this small like, little crossbody bag and it has like this faux matte um, crocodile print on it and then it has the white color blocking and then it's like an open flap here which is super cute and it has these handles but also the long strap which is just adorable and then the inside looks like that okay and then I went to Victoria's Secret and I'm not gonna show you my calzones but I will show you this cute shirt I got it says party harder spring break 2014 pink nation and I just thought it was so cute it's kind of like a crop top and it was like 20 bucks and I just thought it was so cool I think I don't know if I should put silver glitter on the letters black glitter or if I should tie dye it pink what do you guys think but I'm gonna wear this for spring break for sure we're gonna go to Rosarito again so and then for my birthday my boyfriend Jose got me this beautiful Kate Spade bag in this beautiful mint color we went to the Kate Spade store for my birthday he's like pick out whatever bag you want and to our luck that day they're having a 70% off the entire store sale I know. So we got this for a really good deal. I think it was around $100, which is 
awesome so it's just so pretty and perfect for spring do you guys like it I have one just like it in white and then this type of shape is my favorite shape for handbags because it's just very classic I can carry it like this it also comes with the crossbody so it's just so like classic and timeless I'm I'm in love and then I went to G stage and I went with my friend Noelle um, I told her what are you doing today let's go shopping in LA and I took her to G stage because they have an awesome plus size section up to 4x which is amazing and it's really cute stuff so if you're more on the plus size section definitely check out G stage I think it's just in SoCal though and I got this really pretty like chiffon blouse and it has like this nice detailing with the crochet on the top and in the back and it's just so pretty I know it's black and I do have a lot of black stuff but I wear black year round so it's just I know I'll get a lot of use out of it and then I got this top because it just reminds me of growing up in the 90s with this daisy print and daisies are a big trend for spring and it's just like a muscle tank type of dealio with like this big daisy on it and I just think it'd be cute with like some shorts and just some cute little sandals or something and I don't know I just think it's very simple to like layer or whatever oh my god if you hear noise Ruby and Esma are singing so you've been warned I got this really nice um, chiffon tank and it's like this gray color with this floral pattern and I really liked it because of this aspect of it it has like holes in the front and in the back and when I put it on it just it's draped so pretty and it's kind of like droopy in the back bottom and it's just so cute and it was only 15 bucks so and then I also got like this I think it's a dress but I'm not I don't think I'd wear it as a dress unless I put shorts under it but they had these at forever too but I just like this print at G stage more than the ones at forever and this one was 12 bucks. I got this tank and it's like in this taupe color and it has like this lace in the cream and it says love on it. I just thought it was super cute and it's like razorback in the back and this one was $12.99 and then this shirt made me laugh so much and it was only 6 bucks and it is so me that I had to get it. It says I hate Mondays and it's like a muscle shirt. And I was just like, I, I seriously do hate Mondays, like, oh, uh, I hate to get up, and I always have to wake up early, like, at 5 in the morning, and I'm just, like, snoozing it till, like, 5.50, and it's just like, oh, uh, Mondays are just not my days. So this was just so cute. I would wear it with, like, leather leggings or, like, a skirt or put a blazer over it or just anything because it's just so simple. This is just kind of like a black knitted what is this what is, what is this pattern what is this fabric Mitch I don't know it was only like 10 bucks and it has like rope detailing right here and then I went to this one little store in Santa Barbara I don't even know what it's called but it's like in the I don't even know what it's called it's by like Macy's or something and they had this shirt how much is this shirt 10 bucks and it says California Forever. And also it's like a muscle shirt. I guess this is my new obsession. Muscle shirts with words on it. I don't know why. But I just thought it was so cute. I could dress it up or dress it down. And then I got this shirt too. And this is more like a tank than it is a muscle shirt. This is California in this like rose print. And it has like this like crochet in the back. But it was just like one of those like... You know like those little stores that like, they try to be like forever, but they have like other, like, you know what I mean? Like those like random stores. I keep, I keep wanting to call them boutiques and making them fancier than what they are, but they are not boutiques. Boutiques, they have more furniture than they do like clothes, so. And then I went to this other store and this skirt was on sale for 12 bucks. And I'm not going back there. Those girls were rude. Every time I went into a corner, they would like come up to me all quick like, you need help with anything? And I was just kind of like, how come you only ask me for help when I'm in a corner? Like, do you think, like in the corner of a, st in the store, like, you know, the, like, you know, like, I was just like, I'm not going to steal anything. I seriously just wanted to like get one of everything in the store and just mess up the dressing room just to be like, there, like, leave me alone. 
this was like the only thing that I was like, okay, it's cheap, it's cute, I'm gonna buy it. The rest of the stuff, you guys can go suck it because I was just so mad at them. They're just so rude. I hope they follow everybody, not just me because, you know, because, you know, you know, like, whatever. But it's just like this maxi skirt and it has like this short skirt underneath. And what I liked about it was the slit. Because I don't know if you can see it right there. It's like crisp, like crossed like that and then the last thing I seriously need to stop I went to forever and apparently lost my mind these shorts in this print these are only 1080 and it's this really nice like soft like woven fabric I like this fabric more than I do cotton because I feel like they last longer in the wash and then I got this really long um, cream taupe cardigan and it's just like really long it goes past my knees and I just think it's like really I, I'm a cardigan hoarder I will admit it you will see in a second I went cardigan crazy but I just feel like that's really cute for any outfit just I just throw cardigans over everything I got these shorts and like this mint color and this is I went a size up because I wanted it to be a little bit looser, not so fitted. And it's like, it looks like a skirt, but they're shorts. And they're from Love 21. I guess crochet is the thing for spring because I grabbed a lot of crochet stuff. Like this has like this like detail on the bottom. And it's kind of like a crop top. And this one came in like pink and mint and this cream color. But I don't know why I didn't grab the other colors. Hmm. And then I got these shorts that have like, I don't know, these just black shorts. These are like 20 bucks and they have like tejido. What do you call this? I don't know what you call this. They have, they have this crap on the bottom. I thought they were cute. And then I got this plaid shirt. Sometimes I feel like being a grungy girl. And I just like this plaid print over all the other ones. It's like a navy blue with a red go with my hair and then I got this maxi skirt in this beautiful blush color and it has like these sexy slits I got this a-line um, faux leather skirt and it's kind of matte it's coming up way shinier on camera but it's it's definitely more on the matte side and this was only $12.80 and I don't think it's spring necessarily but I, I think you can make it spring and then I, I'm obsessed with these like harem pants like I always feel like if I'm having a fat day like I just feel like like just super like ugh. like I'm just gonna bust out with these pants and these are like this like black and white print don't even say tribal you know how I feel about that word I'm just like no but they're like this black and white print and then they kind of like cinch at the bottom gray and they're all the same they're just different colors because you know I couldn't decide so I was like I'm gonna take them all because I was crazy apparently and then in black I got this shirt sweater no sweater sweater sorry in blush and it came in this one I think it's still available online it comes in blush navy cream black and taupe but I just wanted this color not blush pink baby pink I don't know I thought it'd be cute with some of those shorts I bought and then because apparently I love pink now I got this this is pretty this comes in like all the colors it's part of like they're not so basic can you see that Whoops. and then this lady was returning this blouse I don't know why she's crazy and I wanted it because they didn't have any other ones in the store. And she was taking freaking forever. I was just kind of like, uh, are you going to return that or what? And they were like, she had to exchange it. So she was looking for something else. And I was just like waiting forever in a day. Because I was like, okay, like I want this blouse. And there's none in the store. So apparently you got it somewhere else. And I freaking want it. So I had to wait like an hour. For her to find something else and then finally it could be mine, you know, so they could like resell it or whatever. And it's just like, 
this cute, it has like these cute cutouts in the sleeve and it's like high low and it's just like peasant ish. I got this one, it was on sale for five dollars and I just thought I'd wear it like around the house or something or to work out. It says no! And then I also got this tank guy and it's like in this print this like floral print and it was only 1080 and then when I bought it my roommate Gabby saw it and she's like oh my god I want one I also got another printed muscle tank I'm obsessed I know this one says sweet nothings and it was only 1280 and it has like this like ooh open back woo sexy back hopefully my lonjas don't pop out but and then I got this knitted fringy cardigan guy and this I wore with like a boho kind of flowy dress and it's just super cute which I've shown on Instagram already if you guys don't follow us on Instagram I post a lot of like fashion stuff and like my nails and hair and like all, the, all that cutesy stuff and then this cardigan I think I'm gonna add black fringe to it to make it even cuter but what do you guys think should I just leave it alone it's just like this black floral print kimono kind of a guy but I think I want to add black fringe to the bottom because it's pretty long but I think it'll give it a little extra something something I got this top and this is kind of like a crop top but on the longer end and it has this crochet detail at the bottom and then another cardigan oh my god I need to stop seriously but this one was so cute and it was different from the other one because it had this like nice like lacy crochet detail at the bottom okay so I got these chanclas and these are just like in brown and black and I'm a size 9 so if you think they're massive well then no they're not that massive they're not like a 20 or something do they even make size 20 for girls I don't know these are only 1280 and I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of these like I live in chanclas like I'm in SoCal so it's like it's always hot and then I got these shoes and I thought they were super cute I love this color this like camel cognac what do you guys call this color what do they call this color brown okay well brown I like the buckle details I think it's a very sleek shoe to wear with like skinny jeans tucked in or to wear with like a dress or like those loose flowy shorts or something. I just think it's super cute. And I'm obsessed with these shoes that I'm about to show you. Like, I just feel like they look so expensive because they were like 40 bucks. Which I think is expensive for forever because I can get $40 shoes at Ross that are Steve Madden. But these were just so cute. Okay, so these little babies, I feel like they look really expensive. They're caged, they're faux leather, they have a nice chunky heel, which makes them super comfortable. Comfortable? Did I say comfortable? Com comfort, comfort, ugh, comfortable to wear it. And they have this three buckle detail, so they're not super annoying to put on. Because there was this other one that had buckles, like all, everything, and no. No, ain't happening. So these are just super cute. I'd wear it all the time. And then the last thing I got, I'm really, I was really looking for some shorts. So I really liked these shorts. And my butt doesn't stick out of them, which you think it would. But like you see a lot of leg because they're like cut, like going up. But it's fine. I was going to wear them with like long cardigans. So like if there's butt going on action, there won't be because my butt will be covered. But, 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 okay. So I got these over the knee socks and these are like in this lace kind of pattern. Which I think it'd be cute with like long boots and just have a little bit of the lace showing. Or with like a grungier look or something something and then I got this pretty necklace and I'm digging this Zara packaging that's going on makes it look fancier and this one came in mint too but I kind of like the cream a little bit more and then I got this like boho 
headband guy. Oh, can you see? It's like, you know? It has like double knotted. And these came in like all the colors. And then I also got this very simple black lacy floral guy. It has like little like gems on it. Super pretty. Very simple. And then I got a brown belt because I needed one. And this one's only 7 bucks. This one's called Jelly Belly. It's like a turquoise green kind of color. Oh, and then I got these sunglasses. There were so many sunglasses to choose from and I really could not decide. They're pink and they have like pink and green and yellow like the dealio going on. I don't know. I thought they were super cool. Because I love to wear like very bright lipsticks. So I just think it would go with all my lipsticks. Also got this hat. Like this like floppy boho-y kind of hat. And it was only like 12 bucks. Do I look like a douche? No. I think it's cute. So I also got this necklace. And this came in like a bunch of colors too, but I just wanted the white one. And I think that's it for forever. Okay, and then my mom got me all this jewelry for my birthday and it's just so pretty. I don't know where, probably downtown. There's this one. Super pretty. I, I seriously don't know where, so. Um, probably downtown. That's usually where she gets her stuff. Downtown LA, in case you're wondering. And then she got it for me in red to match my hair. This, like, turquoise one. It was like an ombre kind of deal going. And then she got me, like, another ombre necklace. Okay, and that's it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this ridiculously insane haul. I know I was like, you went crazy. I know I went crazy. I need to stop. I probably will just, you know, I'll stop for a second. Hopefully you guys got some inspiration for your spring wardrobe. If you want to see like a spring lookbook, let me know. Definitely check us out in all our social medias. We're on Twitter, Formidable Art, and then Facebook, Form Formidable Artistry, just how it's spelled here. And then Instagram and Pinterest. Thank you guys so much for watching and supporting, and I'll see you next time.